All right, guys, end of the night. You know the routine. I'm going to start my night off right, so when I go to bed, I think all positive thoughts to line me up for the next day. Tomorrow's podcast, podcast Monday. Um, I'll record my podcast. i got to make some calls, line up for the week, and see how uh, tomorrow's a big day for us. We're going to see what the numbers look like without dialysis from Saturday. So fingers crossed, uh, power, prayers, everything you can. We really appreciate it. Ready? I am ready. My efforts help me succeed. I can make a real difference, and my hard work will pay off. I am strong. I have the power to make the right choices for me, and I have faith in my abilities. I got this. I'm grateful for what I can do, and I'm happy to be me. My goals are achievable, and I am confident. I'll be kind to myself today, and I'm on the right path for me. I deserve love in my life, and I'll take actions to accomplish my goals. I will celebrate the progress I'm making to reach my goals, and I'll look for the good in things. I'm always learning. I trust myself, and I'll try new things. I'll turn negative thoughts into powerful positive ones, and I'll accept myself as I am. I love myself. I'll make time for what brings me joy, and I am powerful. I believe in myself, and it's okay for me to have fun. My possibilities are endless. I'm well-rested and full of energy. I'm relaxed and at peace. I'm strong in mind, body, and spirit, and my life is a gift. I deserve love and happiness, and I care for myself. A healthy food fuels my body, and today I'll take steps to reach my goals. I give myself room to make mistakes and grow, and I'll find moments of joy today. I embrace my power. Now, I tell you guys, I've been sharing this goal of financial freedom. By December 31st of 2024, I will be completely debt free. Pay off my mortgage, my house payment, uh, my my car, my mortgage, my car payment, or my car note, credit card bills, student loans, and any personal loan gone. And I'll also have made a million dollars sitting in my bank account by December 31st of 2024 after taxes. The kicker is, every year thereafter, I'm now going to double that initial million. So next year, I'll make $2 million, so then I'll have $3 million. The following year, I'm going to make $6 million because I'm going to double that $3 million, then I'll have $9 million, so forth and so forth. I'm going to do this by setting up wealth, excuse me, wealth generators that will continue to make money upon money upon money for the rest of time. My family will never be able to spend it all, let alone give it away. We are going to break generational curses, and I'm going to do it in such a manner that anybody follows what I did, applies it to their life with their definitive purpose, with their persistence, with their desire, faith, and grit, and just a little bit of luck, meaning that you have the faith to step through when opportunity presents itself, you can change the course of your family. I, in exchange for this, I will give everything I have mentally, emotionally, spiritually, and physically, because finances will take care of itself. Take care of the first four, the fifth one falls in line. I'm going to do this by building a social media empire, a juggernaut that is a continuous force of good that is based on building a social media empire and helping you achieve your goals and dreams, therefore achieving my goal and dream of changing the world through random acts of kindness. I will also commit to myself that I will never, ever settle. I will never, ever get comfortable in the comfort zone where hopes, dreams, and ambitions go to die. I will continue to be pushing forward because you got three, three directions of motion every day. You're either going backwards, you're staying stagnant, going in a circle, or moving forward. And even if you fail forward, it's one step closer to your goal than failing backwards. So always be pushing yourself. Today was a great day. I mean, there were some bumps in the day, let's be honest, but overall, it was a great day. And you'll never in a million years hear me say that it's all beyond my control. My attitude creates my reality, and I'm sure you can agree that it does, it's not true that good exists only if one's surroundings are good. True happiness will be attained because it's all in my mind and heart, and it's not true that satisfaction and happiness don't last. Goodness will always shine through, even if the world seems like it's a pretty evil place, because when you take a closer look, there's always something good in every day. And don't try to convince me that today was the absolute worst day ever. Because what you believe is what you achieve. If you think you've been beaten, you are. If you think you dare not, you don't. If you like to win but think you can't, it's almost certain that you won't. If you think you lose, you've lost. For out of the world we find, success begins with the person's will. It's all a state of mind. If you think you're outclassed, you are. You got to think high to rise. 
You got to be sure of yourself before you can ever win a prize. Life's battles don't always go to the stronger or faster man, but sooner or later, the one who wins is the one who thinks he can. What you believe is what you achieve. And I was talking to a housemate and I told them that if you don't believe, believe that I believe until you can believe and then do me a favor, a random act of kindness, pay it forward to the next person who may be struggling with that belief. It's just that simple. In a world where you can be anything, be kind. It's the only thing known that's priceless and free and it will change the world. We are changing the world one random act of kindness at a time. Till tomorrow.